push the ball. Yeah. There you go. You there you Thank you. you. Oh, come on. You so much. Most active place that we've had. St Crispin's Mental Asylum. There was a moan on camera. You gotta remember, back in the day, there was there was no treatment. Devil? No. Shut up. I'm scared. I feel I'm never scared. scared. There were no tablets, there was no medicines. Can I step out, man? Yeah. Of course. I'm not happy. I just feel like... What's that? I feel like I'm gonna puke. Right. I've never seen him like that. If you were deemed insane, you were put in one of these places. Whoa, she's pulling me. It wasn't Fuck me, you. mate. It's been very active. We've only been here an hour. <laughs> Thousands upon thousands of mentally ill patients have come through these doors. Jacob, do you mean us harm? Yes. Let us hear your voice. Fuck it now. This, this is fucking weird tonight. You have to do something. And you know what, Rich? Some have never left. Welcome to the gates of hell. Good evening everyone, welcome to another episode from WLP. West London, paranormal. Rich is back with me, and what a place I've taken him today. Christmas Eve, you guys are sitting at home with your mince pies? Yeah. I've brought Rich to the famous Northampton St Crispin's Mental Asylum. What a place, already we've been here 15, 20 minutes, and we've all got shivers running down our spine. This place was built in 1873, opened its doors to the first patients, 1876, closed its doors to the last patients, 1995. What happened between those dates awaits us tonight. Rich, paranormal investigators have been here before. They don't they... want to come here anymore. No. We've had stories from the local investigator around here. You may know him, Mickey York. He is joining us tonight with Nick Stepani. Mickey's been here before. He's seen apparitions, figures, EVPs. He's even been chased out of here before. What awaits us tonight, Rich? What I don't know. I really don't know, Mark, but I can feel something, something is stirring. Yeah. <laughs> Guys, we are here. We are at St. Crispin's Mental Asylum and what a place to be in. We are with Mickey York and the one and only... Cheer mate. Nick Stepani. Thank I'm me, don't forget me. It's, oh, that's, and, that's and Rich is here as well, you know. <clears throat> you so, this place is renowned for activity. If you watch Mickey's videos on the YouTube, you will know. Mickey, what is... Brought you back to this place, apart from me inviting you. Uh, you, you told me to come back. <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> what have you seen in this place? Tell us. Oh, so much. Just, so much stuff. Here. And heard. And oh, heard. Yeah. Voices, screams, feelings, emotions, full blown apparitions, everything here. Things thrown. <laughs> Things thrown? Yeah. Ho, ho, ho. Nick, <clears throat> anything touched you here? The only thing that touched me today <laughs> was this. Wow. Kim you know, White. That's that that's is a, a Christmas carrot. present from Rich Thank to you, Nick. Sir. It's it is a Rudolph. carrot. It's for Rudolph. I'm not going to say what felt more behind just then, but it was... And if that doesn't win his competition on Facebook for the last comment, I don't nice. know. It was nice. <laughs> so yeah. guys, we're going to kick off now with some calling out and let's see what happens. Here we go. Bef Before we start calling out, um, I'd just like to let you know that we are in a room at the back uh, of St Crispin's Asylum and we have got a music box in the corridor. We also have a uh, cat ball in the corridor. What do we have in here guys? We've got a K2 as well. We have a K2 um, meter in here and we have a digi recorder for hopefully some EVPs to come through. And just to let you know that I, I'm very proud of myself because I did manage to get over a tree and a wall with one arm. Thank you. <laughs> right, guys, we are now under the clock tower above us. Here we go, we're gonna do some calling out. Who knows what we're gonna pick up here. Rich. Well, first of all, 
this building was uh, built in 1873 um, and opened its doors first patients 1876 so let's go right the way back shall we 1876 if you were one of the first patients to reside in this asylum whether you be an adult male female or a child then please come forward show us a sign that you're here with us tonight move something make a noise touch one of us show us some sort of sign that you are present here with us tonight in the corridor we do have a, a motion detector ball if you're here and you would like to move that to let us know that you're here with us please do so Mickey you want to explain what your item does yeah we've also got a music box in the corridor as well and it's a motion sensored one so anything that goes within a meter of that device of the sensor it will start to play the tune so do you know what I'm not saying this, but you, you, you've got something over your face I don't know whether it's the light, but it's just, you're all blacked out. It's weird. It's like, you're like an old per... Uh, it could be the... Years old. It could yeah. be the light from... It is probably the from, light. From it's the, just like your face has changed. Back the screen there. Don't say that, because last time I was in this room, I was very yeah. badly affected. I actually cried in this room. Really? Did you? And I never you cried. Did. Yeah. See, I didn't know none of that. Yeah, I, I cried. I can see it over your yeah. face. I don't well, know. Yeah. I can't see anything. I came from here, it's like a black mass over his face. Okay, swap, like swap places there. with me, Mark. Yeah, stay here. <laughs> It, it might have gone, but I just, it's different here. <clears throat> I love Mark so much. <laughs> wow. He says the nicest things to me. I did hear a moan yeah. when yeah. he decided to move over there. And I said, watch the ball. He said, yeah. It was like a ball. The ball, ball, the ball. ball. Like, the ball is going off. If you can see that, the ball is going off. And it's on camera. It's, it is it's on, on camera. camera. Thank you. If you are confirming that you are here, do that again for me. But what we're going to do now is we're going to use the Paratech, which is this one here, which is like the obvious, it's a new one out. Um, we are going to see if we can get any relevance come through. So we're just going to start it out now. At any time during this experiment with <coughs> us, please feel free to move the cat ball right, to so let us know you're with us. that's come through already. Keith. Suspect. Keith, Keith suspect. Keith, are you a suspect? Keith is a suspect. So we've just got Keith suspect. Keith, is that you that's here? I didn't hear it. Devil? No. Shut up. Devil. Why is it I go everywhere? Everywhere. Devil. Devil. My God, I go Cayman Island. Satan. I come to Crispin's. Oh, yeah. Devil. This is a joke now. This is getting beyond a joke. What was that? Probably me going like that. Okay. Malachi. Malachi. What's that? Is that a devil? So it's a boy's name. Yeah. Malachi. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa. Thank you. I called it. I called Malachi and it went off. Malachi and it went off. So okay, so these names that we're we're getting through, obviously, thousands of. I'm going to call you patients because back in the old days, nobody really gave a toss about someone who had any mental health issues, mental health problems. That people were just thought to be mad and insane. Um, obviously, nowadays, with evolution, it has come Travis. forward. And it is more renowned as a mental health medical problem. But back in those days, people would just. Oh, thank, you. thank you. Somebody's just stepped in front of the, the box. Music, music box. The music box has just gone off. The music box. Will you see that or not? No. no I, see, I saw the light. I saw the light there. It's gone, it's gone off again. I heard no a light. footstep there, but no light. Footsteps. Keep going guys. That's it. Well done. Well done. Absolutely awesome. Doing really well. You are doing fantastic. Keep it going. Step in front of it again, please. Hey, we just had crisis come up on the screen. Okay. You come on, if there's any crisis, children here. We need to help. If you're calling out for us to help, you're trapped here, or you want to see the light, we can help you. While irrelevant. I love it how it stops when you get it on camera. I know. <laughs> so if you are trapped and you want us to help you, we are peaceful, we are here in peace. We want no harm. Whoa. Brilliant. Fantastic. We want no harm to come to us at all. Oh. Tell me you're getting that, Mark. 
you want to come into the room? You like me in this room, don't you? There's a shadow behind it. Liberty. Well done, thank you so much. There's a shadow behind it. Is that Mark? No, there shouldn't be because there's no light behind me. No, you're getting refraction from the manor. If you're in front of the, the music box, can you move the ball as well? Where's the ball? Is it clear? Yeah. So we've got the ball and we've got the light. If there's a child there standing watching us, we mean you no harm. We or, thank an you. or an adult. Or an adult. Lady. Can you just step away from the oh music God. box? It's a teacher. Is it a teacher? Hmm? It's a teacher. Are you a teacher? Step away from the music box if you can, please. Can you move away? Just move away for a moment. Come on. Okay, I'm still seeing the shadow there. I don't like either. I'm thinking it's Mark with the light reflection. Painter. Are you a painter here? Was you a caretaker? We can hear pigeons in the background. <coughs> That's for the sake of the digi recorder and the video. Can you stop playing the music box? Step away from it, please. Just for a moment. Push the ball. Thank you. Oh, come on. Thank you so much. Oh, come oh, on. That's Mark. Thank you very much, Spirit. Yeah. What the hell? Thank you That's so fantastic. much. We really appreciate this interaction. Cold, yeah. I'm freezing. God cold. bless you. If Thank that, you so much. If that's you, if you've come to join us, if you've walked into the room, can you push the. Oh. Brilliant. It's not me. Thank you so much. Concrete Can you stop? Thank you. Can you push the ball one more time? Third time lucky. Sentry. The century. He is the 21st century. Please. You have joined us in the 21st century. Thank you. Thank you. Rick, you just explain what you're getting, Rich. Um, I'm getting the word mutating uh, come through on the on like the ovulus uh, machine. But I just had a footstep there. What's it's doing? declining to mutate. Mickey staring at the wall. Mickey, are you with us, yes or no? Yeah. What are you doing? It's all right, no, you're leaving. He just said, yeah. He's down the corner. Oh. Right, so Mickey's in the corner. I can't see anything. He can't I just see said, anything. Mickey, are you okay? And what did Mickey say? Yes. yes. What does the paralyst say? Yes. Yes. <laughs> the paratech has just confirmed he's okay. Thank you. Right, we'll try it again. We are here now. You, we've got so much energy. Okay, safe word is gold, right? If I ask you your favourite colour, you answer that. Just so I know it's you, right? right? Cruise. Any spirit wants to enter this room, come forward. We mean you no harm. And we expect no harm to come of any of us. But you're not entering me. <laughs> <laughs> Without Mickey's permission. Or maybe you're already in this room. And in Mickey. If there is someone in here now with us, can you touch one of us? There are four people here. I'm walking around. So you just touch my hat. Did it? Turn the camera off. I have had people. Something has just touched me on the top of the hat. Hands have been touched in this room. So if you have your hands. It's down, like it poked right. the top bit. Okay, I've had the name called Adriel. You so Adriel, are you here with us? Can you let us know you're here? Clayton, What's going on, Mick? What's going on? Right. Such a bad headache, just instantly just come on, come over. It's like someone was from above. And last time I was expected, we were here, weren't we? Yeah. Around this, just this bit. Yeah. So that, this sort of area, I mean, I don't know what this bit was. Right. Someone, someone call up the I'll name Jacob. I'll go in this corner. Someone call up the name Jacob, please. Jacob, Shh. okay, we've been told to call. What's up? I heard the Some footstep out of the room. There's something bang. Um, Jacob. The word transport. Jacob, are you here with us? Are you in the room? Mickey, what was this room? I don't know. So I said I don't know much about this bit at all. It is, yeah. So any any answers 
will be recorded on that. Had the painter come back second time? Second time. There must be a caretaker. Yeah. You, so again? If you if you are a caretaker from this building, whatever decade or century, please come forward, touch one of us, touch one of us, touch Nick in the corner. It's freezing in here. Touch me here. Touch Nick in the corner. Is that the naughty corner? Can I step up? Yeah. Of course. I'm not happy. I just feel like... What's that? I feel like I'm going to puke. Right, okay. Don't go too far, mate. Just out here, Mickey. Last time I didn't leave and shit went south. Okay, so don't go too far, though. Well, just for the camera, Mickey is... Don't go too is, far, call me, I'll come with you. Mickey's leaving the room, he's not feeling too great. Mickey's just left the room. He's, he feels like he's been affected with a headache. He's um, had this experience before in Crispin's. Can you see Mick? Last time, guys. Can you see Mick? Here. I've got Nick on here, yeah. How are you feeling, Nick? I'm alright. Yeah, yeah all right? I'm, I'm okay. I'm actually warmed up now. <laughs> yeah, I'm okay. I'm okay. But the last time Mickey was here, guys, I've never seen him like that. It was. It affected him massively. And t to the extent that he was crying. Right, okay. So, so we, have a, we have a K2 meter now on the floor. Elijah. That's, that's a young boy's name, Elijah. Elijah. If you were with us for any of this journey tonight, can you give us a physical sign? We mean you no harm. We're not a doctor, we're not a medical person, we don't wear white jackets, we do not harm people, we do not test on people. Thank you. K2. K2, wow. Thank you. Off, yeah. We're going to turn it off, flick it I over. Don't look out that window. So we're now going to yes, no with the Paratech. Uh, we're going to start calling out for the name. <coughs> Jacob. So we've got, we've got something right, it's just rebooting. So we're going to start by calling out. Oh, if, Jacob. Is that Jacob, are you here in this room with us? Is the spirit called Jacob that is in this room with us? You, yes. Are you a child, Jacob? Are you a child, Jacob? No. Jacob, are you over 40 years old? Yes. Are you a patient at this hospital? Are you a patient at this hospital? No. Are you a worker at this hospital? Yes. Doctor. Are you a doctor at this hospital? Jacob, are you a doctor? Jacob, are you Dr. Jacob Cole? No. Ask that again. Are you Dr. Jacob Cole? Yeah. No. no. Jacob, do you mean us harm? Yes. Was that you affecting Mickey, Jacob? It's gone into question mark, doesn't understand. Was it you that was affecting Mickey with the headache earlier? Was that you using his energy? Come on, Jacob, you understand what I'm talking about. Were you causing Mickey harm? Jacob, let's, let's turn it, tone it down a little bit. Let's ask you. Doesn't want to answer the questions. Yes. yes. There you go. Cheers for that. Yes, Jacob. So Jacob, Jacob, did you harm patients? Did you hurt them? Yes. Did you say yes? Yeah. You bastard. <laughs> no need for it. Yes. Does we... Jacob, it's obvious that you want to prey on the weak. So I suggest that you move on from this place. I suggest that you leave right now. I suggest that you are banished. Did, did you hear that laughing? Yes. Yes. I heard that at all. It's like a woman laughing. Yeah, it was like a hee hee hee. That's what I heard earlier. And just as Rich was doing yeah. that, something grabbed my knee. Just saying. Jesus Christ. Yeah. Jacob, be gone. Oh, of course. <coughs> yeah.
mm. to themselves or to someone else. Let's do a spirit box session in here. Yeah, this is a, this is a staff quarter, so I'm telling you now, 100%. We're on AM 150 in reverse. We are in what we believe to be maybe a staff room. We call for the spirits that reside in here. Jacob, if you're here. Me. What have I got in my hand? What has Nick got in his hand? What is Nick holding in his hand? Does anyone want to come forward and give me a name? Michael. Do you know who Michael is? Fuck you. I'm sure I said fuck you, yeah. Fuck you, I'm just saying. I'll tell you what. Fuck again, you. again. again. Yeah. Whoa, there's no need for that. That's twice. Tell us any message, go. Drop dead. What? Drop dead? Oh. I I'm scared. I feel I mean, never get scared. scared. Yeah? Like there's something here following us and it's coming for us. Okay. That's, that's how I feel. And it's because I saw that fucker in the corridor there. Say. Who do we have here? He's coming. coming. I He's thought coming. I heard that earlier. He's coming. Oh my god! What? It said, oh my god. A lady's voice, he's coming, oh my god. Maybe she's scared, oh man. <laughs> Joe, are you here, are you a child? Yes, yes, yeah, I heard that, yeah. <laughs> you an idiot. Yeah. Joe, do you need help? Do you need help, Joe? <laughs> that you are talking about or is there another Nick? Do you know what that just said? What? I don't know if he went, I'm hearing it. Mike. I thought he said cheer Mike. Mike. Did you think you heard that? Devil. What? Shut up. Devil. Oh, thanks. Well you can piss off. I'll tell you okay. what would be very impressive if you could say my surname. I, I'm going to say my surname. <laughs> Stepani. Say it again. Is that Stepani? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Stepani. <laughs> no way. Come on. Right, what is this in my hand? Carrot. <laughs> Did you hear that? <laughs> Did you hear it? A woman's voice, carrot. Just again, just to be confirming, what is in my hand? Whoa. What? Did you hear that kid scream? No. I heard, yeah. You heard it? Yeah, 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 yeah. It it's was like, hell. It's like, hell. Yeah. It's like outside. Oh, I think you two are all No, seriously. You heard it? You're hearing a lot of things going on over here. Oh, my God. This is fucked. Oh, dead end. Hold on. Oh, okay. This is interesting. What the fuck, Nikki? Oh, 
Someone's had a ritual. Have they left the lighter? <laughs> Imagine that. Right, not being funny. I'm not looking in there. Oh, eh? So you know what I was Correct. Someone's actually trashed these. This is been here for a year. Yeah, they are. Can you put this on? Yeah, yeah. Have yeah. A little look around. So we've just come down into this basement area of the location that we're at. And we've found these candles laid out. There's a board there. And there's a board there which would indicate sitting down. Wow, you wouldn't have to be quiet for that. <laughs> <laughs> All that, for that. It's story time, it's in the 24th century. There's only children down here with us now. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Right. How many children are down here? Maybe you're hiding. Six. Maybe you're hiding. Oh, what is that? What? Did you say fuck it now? Oh. There's someone. No. What? There was someone just standing there just went. Can you play it back? No, I had the camera on me. I took it away for two seconds. And there was someone standing because I was feeling all this. And there was well, someone that just walked along there. Come in. Come into the room. Put it on the tripod and leave it at the door. You outside? We've got the ward dates. I don't know what, if any of these names come up. What, Hayes Ward, Graham Ward? Yeah, Laundry. Who's Audrey? Laundry. <laughs> so, oh, surprise. Surprise building. What? Crash. Crash. Grafton Lodge. Connolly Lodge. Red Nile. Red Nile, they're concrete. They're solid. I don't know. I don't know about that bit. Mm -hmm. What takes on this one? Yeah, see? Just there. Hey, hey, hey. Mind the floor. No, that one right there. Yeah, the floor's alright. Careful, for fuck's sake. Okay, so we are now upstairs in one of the buildings. We've got to be quiet. Mickey, what have you got with you? We've got the Alice DNA box. Okay. And we're going to see if we get any relevant names coming through. Any words can help. I mean, we've had some great feedback with this before haven't we yeah we've used it before and it is very good let's go so. oh, yeah. spirits anyone that resides in this building is attached to this building that's followed us here come through and pass a message yeah we don't mean you any harm we just want to communicate with you see who you are find out why you're still here or even just tell us your name. Can you hear that time? Yes. I think that's the water. 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 Water dripping. It's all on the Voice. Give us a moan, a growl. we speak to downstairs who did mark see or thought he saw walking into the room can you use this device to give us your name please you scared him what is that is that your belly rich a pigeon no what? i can hear a yeah that's not a pigeon i didn't hear it. i've got my hat over my ears now yeah it was like okay. yeah. behind them two Oh my god. In that room that we don't oh. like. Oh, yeah, oh my god. As soon as I open the yeah. door, I hate it. Oh my god. Is there a window in that door? No. Yes. But no glass. No, it's hollow. hollow. That's what I'm saying. In there glass in it. Yeah. No, I heard yeah. a man's voice then. Right, come out. Can you push the door open? Are you able to do that? If anything happens, don't run. You can lay in a full throw. Yeah, don't run. Mark. <laughs> ready. 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 Okay. okay. We ready. are ready. We're born ready. 
Rich. Rich. <gasps> what? Shut up. I'll get a photo. Can I get a picture for Rich? Yeah. Spirit decides to ruin my night and take it. Jesus. That is crazy. Yeah, I hate so Rich doesn't like that room there. I hate that room. Why do, what don't you like about it? Because the first thing you said it's when you looked at it, you didn't like it. Before we had any of the spirit boxes going, well, that's the Alice box, right? Yeah. Yeah. Look at that, Rich, ready. Before we had. Birth. Before we had. <laughs> Whoa, stop pulling me. It wasn't Fine. me, mate. It's not, it's not touching you. I haven't even touched you. Who fucking no. pulled me down here? I thought you just slipped. Now <laughs> someone grabbed my bag and pulled me. It's well, like lower like me, me, mate. My hand just said. Not. There you go. <laughs> not. <laughs> not. Rich didn't pull you then. He didn't touch you, mate. Wow. There's no, there's floor there. no there's there. not safe floor. I have a look again. No, just stand here. Literally just here on the floor. Don't have to go in there. Just stand here. So go on, Mickey. What's he doing? We have just got on the box. Let me just lure it and show you a picture on the camcorder. This is not nice. Rich, ready. Rich, are you ready? So come on then, spirit. Rich ready. Rich is ready. And he's in that room that you asked him to go to. Give us a minute. Dan. 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 Half Dan. Well done, half. Is that who's upstairs? Is Rich in the room with Dan? How do you feel, Rich, in there? Um, I'm all right, but... Is that because we stood next to you? No, 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 I'm, I'm all right, but the thing is, I would like to go further, but I can't because of the floor. I'd like yeah. to go in the room down the end, but obviously the floors, there's no ceiling here, so I can't mm. go any further, literally. Two steps, I can't go any further. But something's not right up here. I'm feeling very cold. Hope. Hope. I'm feeling like there's an energy that Hold wants on. me to go across yeah. to the other side. Mm. It's like something wants to pull me across the other side. I'm feeling like I want to walk across there. Do you understand what I mean? Yeah, something's pulling you there. Drawing you there. It's yeah. drawing me, not physically pulling me. Yeah, but you know what I mean. Not pushing me or anything like that. Yeah. But it's dr something's drawing me to go to that room across there. Soft. But my legs are yeah. freezing. I mean my thighs, nothing else. My thighs are freezing. Is there any windows in there? There's a window open right down the end. Yeah. I mean next to you there's a room. No, I don't mm. think so. Mm. But it's it's eerie in here. It's it's not pleasant. It's not a nice feeling. Jesus. Yeah, I'll come out. It wants me to walk across. Yeah, yeah. I can't because yeah. I fall through. Yeah, try Oh, I really want to go across. It's like pulling me, you know what I mean? It's drawing me across. It wants to, whatever. I want to go across there, but I can't. But you're not going to do that. It's stupid, I can't. What if you went to the other staircase and went to the top of the stairs, but we didn't, and stopped there, obviously. That's basically where it wants you to go. Yeah, but it wants me in that end room. Oh, okay. It's the end room, not the landing. So it'd be pointless. Oh, man. Yeah, that's there's something I can feel something there. That's oh, yeah. uh, that's not good. That's drawing me to that. I don't want to. Well, I'll be drawn, but I can't because of the floor, <laughs> which is a little bit <coughs> a dead end, really. And that's a shame because I'd like to go across there. Right. Mm. Guys, we are back where we first started the investigation. We're in one of the rooms here just beneath the clock tower. In this room, we had Mickey and the uh, what was it you had? Music box. The music box. In the corridor. Oh, in the corridor. We heard footsteps out there. It lit. It went off. We had the cat ball down there. It went off. Rich, who did you speak to down here? A man called Jacob. We believe he was a medic here during the 1800s or early 1900s, working on patients. I had a confrontation with him. I hope you enjoyed it. Nick, how do you feel in this room? Uh, it's good to be back. Um, earlier, though, when all that was kicking off. I don't like to use the term kicking off, but that's what I'm gonna say. Um, felt quite uneasy, actually. Uneasy. Yeah. Mickey, how are you feeling now that you're back in this room? 
I'm feeling alright at the moment. <coughs> See, earlier on I wasn't too happy, I wasn't feeling good. I had to leave, feeling sick, feeling dizzy. Not good. At the yeah. moment, I'm okay. We're all so good. We'll Everyone is feeling good at the moment. Yeah. We are now going to try out the finale. We're just going to go and we're going to see what we can get here. We haven't done the spirit box in here, we haven't done other bits. Yeah. Let's get going. Okay. Let's get to the camera now. <coughs> okay, spirit. We're back in the room where we were earlier. Are you happy we're back? Do you like us in here? Do you have any messages for one of us? When the beat drops, spirit well. <laughs> Light that ball up. Sarah. Yeah, I heard that. Hey, Sarah. Are you the granddaughter? Have you heard any other names before? Mm. No names? Mm. Hmm. You guys feeling alright, yeah? Yeah. Yeah, not bad, yeah. <coughs> I have two names from previous visits that haven't come through tonight. First one is Nancy, he's a nurse. And um, like an orderly, he used to go around like a porter. His name is Ryan. Okay. From the admin building <coughs> down in the cellar. Well, where we were? Yeah, Ryan. But it's so that could be the so. Could be Ryan, he might have down there. Yeah. There we go, guys. That is it. We are finished filming St. Crispin's Mental Asylum. What a night. Wow. Christmas Eve, you are sitting there watching us, entertaining you guys, and what a night it's been. We've had banging, we've seen stuff, we've heard knocks, we've had the boxes going off, we've had communication, but we will review this when we get home, and you'll see it on the video, we'll edit it. Yeah. Rich, what did you think of tonight? It's all right. First time here. I don't think, uh, I don't know, I don't know what I think. Well, you got I mean, quite angry at one point. Yeah. yeah. I was trying to um, up the tempo of the investigation a little <coughs> bit and get into a little bit of a, a ding dong. Mm. And uh, something drew you in. I mean, that spirit box, Rich, what was it? Oh, wow, yeah. Oh. Yeah, it, it called you out. And it wanted you to go in that room and walk across those. The Alice box. Yeah. The Alice in, box. In the admin building, yeah. yeah. Rich, yeah. ready. Rich, are you ready? Yeah, you certainly yeah. were. That I was think. amazing, that was. I mean, That's starting quality. off the night, you didn't feel too great no, in here, but now no. you're all right wrapping up here. Nick, yeah, how are you yeah. feeling? Now? I'm good now, yeah. Um, like I said earlier, when we were just finishing off in this room, it's it's like everything's dispersed. Yeah, it's, it's, yeah the we've energy's heard. gone. The energy's gone. It's given us what we want tonight. Yeah. And guys from us, Nick, Mick, Keith. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. And Rich. Right now I'm laughing. And Rich. Yeah. Merry Christmas, Merry everyone. Christmas, guys. Yeah, very good. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas and cheer. Might. See you later, guys. Oh, yeah. Yes, yes. Whoa. I've got that camera. Oh, 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 oh. 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 Oh,